Nurses don't expect to be thanked. but they deserve to be thanked. Nursing is one of the most professionally, personally and spiritually rewarding career. On a daily basis, nurses do so much for so many, whether they are helping patients, comforting families, teaching students or working with hospital administrators. Their days are often packed but packed with a smile. Today is International Nurses Day, a time to celebrate nurses who are the backbone of every healthcare system, whether it's performing essential services or responding to a crisis. We celebrate them today, but we depend upon them. During the Crimean War, more soldiers died from infection than in battle. Until a nurse introduced sanitary practices still in use today. She was nurse Florence Nightingale. When the scourge of polio hit the world, it was standard practice to strap down and immobilize patients. Until a nurse discovered that movement and physical therapy had far better results. She was nurse Elizabeth Kenny. In the 1960s, jaundice was a leading cause of infant's death until a nurse found that few hours of sunlight could actually cure the condition. She was nurse Jean Ward. At the dawn of AIDS epidemic, no one knew how the disease spread, so patients were kept quarantined and alone, until nurses defied convention and embraced them with compassion. During the Ebola outbreak, the disease was thought by many too contagious to treat until a student nurse used what she had on hand, garbage bags and duct tape, to protect herself so she could care for others. She was nurse Fatu Kekula. Cerebral palsy robbed many patients of their ability to speak until a nurse gave them back their voice. She was nurse Rebecca Kozalinski. Nurses change lives and that changes everything. How are you feeling? Every nurse has asked this question to her patients. This simple question displays their empathy in giving spirit and their amazing heart in one question. How are you feeling? It directly impacts lives, whether it's helping someone recover from an accident, a disability, or just needing someone to feel safe. A nurse is always there. And to this day, without hesitation, even in the face of a worldwide adversity, every day, nurses sacrifice their time, family and well-being to care and protect those in needs. Despised adversity, they still ask, how are you feeling? This very year, KIHS celebrates all nurses and caregivers for their dedication and service. Thank you for being among the first to take action. And while we practice social distancing, thank you for taking the front line during this unprecedented time. Thank you for giving us hope. On that note, we have some nurses emerging from the walls of KIHS to share to us what a nurse is to them. A nurse is a delegator. A nurse is a motivator. A nurse is a caregiver. A nurse is a researcher. A nurse is a coordinator. A nurse is a team player. 
A nurse is an innovator, collaborator, student, teacher and an advocate. These are the hands that touch us first. Feel your head, find the pulse. These are the hands that tap your back, test your skin, hold your arm, wheel the bin, change the bulb, fix the drip, pour the jug, replace your hip. These are the hands that fill the path, mop the floor, flick the switch, soothe the soul, burn the swabs, give us a jab, throw out shops, design the lab. And these are the hands that stop the leaks, empty the pan, wipe the pipes, carry the can, clamp the wings, make the cast, and touch us last. Thank you. We as Koshians are grateful to all the opportunities given to us to learn this noble art. On this Nurses' Day, we the student nurses of Koshi's Institute of Health Sciences salute our Chairman, Dean, Principal and all our dear teachers for all their efforts directly and indirectly to sharpen our skills and to make us think hard work and to prepare us as best nurses to serve the humanity. At the end, let us remember what Florence Nightingale wrote about nursing. Let us never consider ourselves finished nurses. We must be learning all our lives. Happy Nurses Day.